This video explains the difference between RTMP and SRT. RTMP, Real-Time Messaging Protocol, and SRT, Secure Reliable Transport, are both ways of sending video and audio over the internet. They do it differently and are suited for different purposes. RTMP is a communication protocol for streaming audio, video, and data over the internet. It relies on TCP, Transmission Control Protocol, to manage packetization, establish the initial connection, and maintain stability. RTMP maintains persistent connections and allows low-latency communication. Think of RTMP as an older, established method, like sending mail via a standard postal service. It was initially designed for streaming to Adobe Flash Player. While Flash is outdated, RTMP is still used for getting your video from your camera to a streaming platform. Imagine using RTMP to send your live video to YouTube. Your camera encodes the video and then sends it to YouTube servers via RTMP. From there, YouTube distributes it to viewers using other protocols. SRT is an open source transport protocol that delivers audio and video across networks. It does this with minimal lag and maximum reliability. It utilizes UDP, user datagram protocol, and ARQ, automatic repeat request, to deliver video streams. SRT employs error correction techniques and adaptive bitrate streaming to optimize video quality and minimize latency. Consider SRT a more modern and reliable method, like a guaranteed express courier service. It is designed to ensure your video arrives in good condition, even if the internet connection isn't perfect. Imagine you're streaming a live concert from a location with a shaky internet connection. SRT will help ensure that the video makes it to the viewer smoothly. This happens even if some data packets get lost along the way. Here are the key differences between RTMP and SRT. RTMP's reliability can falter on unstable networks. This is because it lacks advanced error correction. With SRT, Smooth streaming, even over unreliable connections through techniques like forward error correction and packet recovery, is ensured. In terms of security, RTMP is more vulnerable to interception due to the lack of built-in encryption. SRT employs symmetric encryption algorithms for end-to-end -end security. RTMP is known for low latency, although this can degrade on unstable networks. SRT is designed to offer low latency while adapting to network conditions. RTMP relies on TCP for its underlying protocol. It guarantees delivery in the correct order. SRT uses UDP but adds its mechanisms to ensure reliability. RTMP relies on TCP for error correction. SRT uses ARQ, automatic repeat request, to request retransmission of lost packets. Finally, RTMP has no built-in encryption. SRT uses AES encryption to protect video streams. If you need a reliable stream over a potentially unstable network and security is a concern, SRT is the better choice. If you're streaming to a platform that still uses RTMP for ingestion and network conditions are good, RTMP can still work.